Hi, welcome to an Inventor 2017 video tutorial, maybe the last 2007, because 2018 is already released. So I want to do the multi-body housing now in Inventor. Therefore I would need some planes. So I might make these visible. And I need one plane with a distance to this one. Distance should be 36. Another one. Distance should be 88. Then one with minus 36 and minus 88. Then another one. In that direction minus five and two one with forty four and another one with a distance to that one and that should be 90. Yes, I could hide this plane. I need a sketch on the XY plane and I need all these planes in my sketch. So I go for project geometry, make it for construction purpose only. I want to have this one and all these so just select them I think I've already got them all apart from this one and that one so I could hide them for the moment just to check yeah now I need a rectangle over here and this should be of course standard and align this one to that one this one to that one and that one to this one this should be a center line and the distance should be 94 diameter so that's not quite right because this has to be up here. Okay, that's more like it. Finish the sketch, make a revolve and it's the first body so no need to go for a new body, just confirm. Let's show these planes. And I need another sketch, again on the XY plane, and again I would have to project these elements, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine another rectangle over here again it should be for not for construction then align this one to that one this one to that one that one to this one give it a dimension and this line should be of course a center line 
and then the dimension should be 94. Finish the sketch. Make another revolve, but now go for a new body. And confirm. Now we've got two solid bodies. This should be right plus that might be left plus. Next sketch, again on the XY plane. Again I need, I could hide these. I need to project these elements. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And that would be a rectangle somewhere here. And again, this should be, of course, not for construction. And I could add already this. And this shouldn't be for construction, but like this. Then trim and this should be extended, but not like this. So this should go, that should go. And this should be extended. Like this. Now let's trim that one as well. Okay, now align this. No, sorry. Make this collinear, this collinear, that collinear, and this should be collinear, and that line should be a center line. Okay, give it dimensions. This should be 56. And this should be 80. Finish the sketch. Make a revolve. And it should be a new body. And confirm. So this is center plus. Okay, next sketch, again on the XY plane, and again I need those elements, so go for project geometry, and make them for construction only, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine. And this should look something like this. Starts here, goes up, over here, up, over here, down, and then an angle, up right here, and of course it should be 
not for construction. Now let's add some constraints. This one to that one, this one to that one, this one to that one, this to that one, this to that one, this to that one. Now let's add at least one dimension and this would be 45 degrees. So now I need a special point right here. Can I do a fillet? Yeah. Fillet should be 12. And like this. That's for construction, that's okay. Now extend this one and that one. Now I could add the dimension from that point to that line and this should be 42. Sketch is fully constrained. Finish the sketch. Now let's make an extrude with that sketch, that's okay, make it in a new body make it symmetric and the distance should be 50 altogether and confirm now I want to mirror this so go for mirror, I want to mirror a body that body and the mirror plane should be this one I could mirror feature as well so maybe I cancel this out and I will mirror a feature because then I will stay in this body so mirror a feature and the feature would be that extrude and the mirror plane would be this plane and okay so I got another solid and I will call this one Stefana. Let's show all the bodies. Okay. And hide all the planes. So I go for hide all planes, at least for the moment. Where are we? Origin planes. work planes. There you go. Now I could add the fillets. So I go for fillet which is 6 on that edge apply on that edge apply on that edge apply and let's hide these. Yeah. and make the fillets right here so first should be 12 here and there apply and then we got 6 millimeter radius here over there here there there behind and this one as well and OK now let's show them very nice now I could just hide these planes as well and make a new body and unite them in this program I cannot create an empty body so I will put them all together in the center plus so go for combine the base would be the center plus and the two bodies would be right plus left plus stiffener and okay I'm almost done what I need to do is the variable radius fillets 
So I'm going for fillet variable and I need one right here. Okay, six is okay. And I need some more points. So if you want to add points, just go right here. Move over the edge and you can catch the center of that edge. And this one would be 20. I need to add two more 6 millimeter radius. One at the end. Just click here. Which should be the end point of that edge. So we go for six and now no here and one over there. And okay. So I need to do this three more times. Again a fillet here and it should be variable radius. Variable. Okay. I need to add one at the end. This one over here at the end. That would be this one. And right there, one in the center. Oh, there it is. You could change this value. So the position point 5 means it's in the middle of that section. And apply. Let's go over here. Again, variable. Select. Select that point. this po point so I missed it so I could go for 0 0.5 and I need another one here in the center and that would be 20 and apply and the last one here again that's the green one and another green one over here and another one in the center right here it's green I'll confirm and this should be 20 as well and okay and I'm done, at least for the exterior of this part. So if you want to see more, give it a like down below, leave a comment, please subscribe. Thanks for watching. See you to the next one, which would be the interior of this part. Bye bye.